I've just found a crazy new video generation model that can go all the way to 60 seconds for each generation. These are some of the results. Best part is that it has text to video, image to video, and video to video. Let's get started. Don't forget to check the link in description for uncensored tutorials, and do give this video a like. Okay, so the tool we're gonna use today, or the tool that I'm talking about, is Magic Hour AI. Just search for it. I did show you all the tool a couple of months ago, but it has come with a whole lot of advancements. So just click on it and you should be presented with this interface. There are a couple of things that you can do. As you can see, you can transform videos into any style, infinite creative possibilities and text to video animation, face swap as well. But let's go to the homepage. And yeah, so with this, you can create engaging AI videos like a pro and you can get started for free, which is one very cool thing. It's perfect for creators, marketers, producers, and even AI influencers. So these are just the tools as I mentioned before, video to video, which is really good. Face swap, which obviously we all need. Then there's image to video. There's animation, text to video, and lip sync. Now the thing about this site is that it allows you to generate videos longer than 10 seconds. I'm talking 15 seconds, 20 seconds, and a maximum of 60 seconds. So unlike other platforms, image to video and text to video can go even beyond 30 seconds. And I'll show you all of that now. So these are just templates that you can use. And these are just some new ones. So let's just sign up. Or in my case, I'll log in with my Google account as always. Once you log in, you can see all the tools. It also has an image generator and face swap. So first of all, let's try the image generator. These are just some of the face swap results. Then if you go from video to video, you can see this one. As you can see, it's extremely cool. It's perfect and it's very fun, especially if you'd like to post it on social media. And there's also lip sync animation. As you can see, it's very good. I'm going to test it out. So let's try the image generator first. And as you can see, it's good with text. So let's just see, let's just type in a prompt like this. When you're done, set the aspect ratio, choose landscape, then the number of images. I'll select three and then hit generate. And let's see how it does. Now in barely any time it is done. And look at how wonderful this is. I might even use it as my sign one of these days. As you can see, it's crystal clear and it got the text perfectly. So you can just download this. Then let's try a normal AI influencer prompt. Then hit generate when you're done with the prompt. So it's done. As you can see, it has done a very decent job. So I know you all are here for the video tools. Let's test it out. Let's go and click on create new projects. We'll first try out the text to video. Then we will describe what we want. Then choose the aspect ratio, 16 by nine. And then as you can see, this is the video duration we can take it all the way to 60 seconds, which is amazing. However, of course, the longer the video, the longer the wait time. So for this video, I think for this particular one, we'll just take it to about 15 seconds and then click on generate. Okay, so now it's done. And I want you to take a look at this. As you can see, it's only 15 seconds and it keeps it consistent. No weird or obvious morphing. And keep in mind that you could even take this thing all the way to 60 seconds. Yes, you heard me right. 60 seconds, as I showed you. So we'll just download it. And we'll try again with a different prompt. We'll go back, then we'll type in a prompt. Set the aspect ratio. Uh, then we'll take this to, let's say about 20 this time around because we don't need it too long. So this is done. This is the result. The face is a bit muffed, but I would say it's pretty decent. And on top of that, it is 20 seconds. So let us now try the image to video. Go here, click on create new projects. Then we'll try image to video. Just click on it. Then upload your image. So I've got this one here. Then I'll put in slow zoom shot. Increase this to about, let's say seven seconds and then click on render. Okay, so now it is done. And I want you to take a look at the masterpiece it created. Don't forget the prompt was slow zoom shot. And as you can see, it's perfect. And this is seven seconds. And you can take it all the way to 60 seconds at that. So let's try another image. And we'll make it longer this time around. So I've got this one here. 
Instead of just putting in a prompt, I want to see how it understands the image as a whole. So I'll just take it here and put it at around, let's see, 14 seconds. And then we'll generate this without any prompt to see how it understands the image. So it is done. Let's look. As you can see, it's pretty decent. The only issue might be with the eyes. But then again, we didn't really add any prompt. So overall, it did a decent job. Let's go back and add a prompt. So what I'll just do is type in a prompt like this. By the way, this is the image that I brought in. And then click on render video. Okay, so it's done. And as you can see, it's slightly prompting, but I've got a near perfect result. And you can take this all the way to 60 seconds at that. So just download it. And now let's try the video to video, which is extremely cool. Just go back here to create a new project then click on video to video, then simply drag in your video. Okay, so I brought in this video here, as you can see. Now, normally you can extend this to how long you want. By that, I mean it uses the length of the video, whether it's 10 seconds or 10 minutes. So let's click on the next step. Now you simply choose the format that you want. I think we can choose GCA, choose the model. We want Dream Shipper, and then click on render video. Okay, so now it is done. And look at the wonderful job it created. As you can see, it's awesome and it's really good. So I will just download it. And let's finally try the face swap option. We go to create and then click on face swap video. Then upload the video. So I've got this one here, five seconds. Of course, if the video is longer, I can make it that exact size, which is awesome. And no other platform out there allows you to do so. Then choose a good face. So I'm gonna use this man's face and we'll click on render video. Okay, so it's done. Let's look at it. As you can see, it's perfect. And it even got the beard as well, which is awesome. So yeah, that's it for this video. The link to this tool will be in the description. And subscribe for more AI-related content like this.